Here comes Santa Claus, here comes Santa Claus, right down Santa Claus Lane. Still no singing. Hey everybody, it's Mama J. And Wingles the Elf. We are here with day 18. Yep, almost there. Yeah, how many more days? Six. Six? That's it? Seven? Seven. More after today. Yeah, six after today. Um, so today what we're going to discuss is Christmas, Christmas movies that were released in 2020. Okay. Okay. Um, we each have a list here. These are movies you're going to find maybe they're on like the Hallmark Channel, Netflix, Lifetime, maybe some other formats, but probably those formats. Okay. Um, some of them are movies, but we all know how that works right now. Uh, so the first one is called Holiday. And it has Emma Roberts in it. I actually did watch this one. Uh, very much Hallmark type of a movie. Um, it's about a woman and a guy who meet up. And they're each other's date to... Well, it starts out with Christmas, you know. And all different kinds of Valentines, weddings they have to go to. It's like a standing date. So they're not dating, but they're a standing date for all these holidays. Okay. So it's a pretty cool movie. So what you got? I have Angela's Christmas Wish, which is the sequel to Angela's Christmas. Yes. And it's about reuniting the family. And that's animated, correct? Yes. Yeah. So um, I have not seen that one yet. Have mm -hmm. you? No. Yeah, I don't think I've seen a lot of these. Um, they are on my list, but I have not seen them all. Uh, the next one is called Dance Dreams Hot Chocolate Nutcracker. It's um, about Debbie Allen, who is a very famous choreographer and, you know, producer and stuff. Um, she, it's a musical, and it's about her putting everything together. Okay. Yeah, and so, um, and I love Debbie Allen. She, uh, back in, I don't know how many people watch this. But many, many moons ago, there was a TV show called Fame, which is one of my favorite all-time TV shows. And Debbie Allen actually did a lot of the choreography for that show and also played a teacher in that show. So and it was on quite a few seasons. A lot of people came out of that show. What else you got? Uh, next on the list is The Christmas Setup, which is a mom sets her son up with a guy he had a crush on in high school. Oh, okay. I haven't seen that one yet. Um, wonder how that one turns out. Don't know. I haven't seen that. <laughs> the next one is called Operation Christmas Drop. And it's about a military base that delivers presents and supplies to the Pacific Islands. And they're talking about closing that base down. What you got? Uh, the next one is A Sugar and Spice Holiday, which is a Chinese-American family uh, with the woman who gets guilted into a gingerbread house competition after her grandmother dies. So a little bit of sappiness and then probably a little bit of happiness. Uh, next, I have Feliz Navidad. And it stars Mario Lopez. Yes, Mario Lopez. And we all know who that is because he's Slater on uh, Saved by the Bell. But... Um, do you not know what that is? Nope. He's not old enough to know what Saved by the Bell is. But it falls into the same category as like Boy Meets World. Um, I, I, that's the closest one I would put it to. Maybe Beverly Hills 90210, but a smaller sitcom kind of thing. Um, it stars Mario Lopez as a single dad who has not enjoyed Christmas since he has lost his wife. So it's kind of like trying to get him back into the spirit. Okay, and then my next one is The Princess Switch, uh, Switched Again, which is a sequel. It's just about two people who look alike and switch places. Yeah, one's a princess and one's not. <laughs> um, the next one is The Christmas Waltz. Christmas Wedding unexpe Unexpectedly Was Cancelled and about how the woman meets somebody else who you know, kind of takes her out of that slump. Right, next we have uh, Dear Christmas, which has Melissa Joan Hart, 
It's a podcast about holiday romance. Another one of them sappy movies, probably. <laughs> um, next one is called Happiest Season. It stars Kristen Stewart and Mackenzie Davis. Um, I don't know who plays who, but they are a dating couple. And the one wants to propose to the other one at Christmas time, but the one has not come out to her family yet. Okay. So, next. Next, I have Merry Little Christmas Wedding, which has Kelly Rowland and Thomas Caddock. It's the sequel to Merry Little Christmas. Yeah, I haven't seen that one yet, but it looks like it might be pretty interesting. Um, and then I also have Jingle Jangle Musical, which, no, the Jingle Jangle is not the drug from Riverdale. It's actually the name of a movie. It's a musical about a toy maker. Okay. And I laugh because when I read that, and I know you don't, but I watched Riverdale, um, and the drug that all the teenagers were, were taking was called Jingle Jangle. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead. Uh, and my last one, I have Christmas on the Square. It's a musical about Dolly Parton that she stars in. Well, it, she star. I don't think it's about her. She actually wrote the story. Oh, okay. And it's about a female Scrooge. Yeah, she stars in the movie. Um, it also had Debbie Allen, who directed that one. It does have other famous people in it. I just can't remember right off the top of my head. But it's a musical. Okay. So, um... It's, you know, about a female Scrooge who, you know, makes everybody's life miserable at Christmas time. So those are all brand new movies from 2020. So, um, you know, I went back and forth because we could do top 10 Christmas movies or whatever. But I figured, you know what, why don't we look into new movies that people might not have seen but might be interested in seeing because they didn't know they existed. So, um... But now, why don't we see what's in our advent calendars? Okay. Behave. All right. So Day we are 18. at the last one of the third row. Yeah, we're getting there. And we have a metallic oh, Goku. That's pretty cool. So a lot of those are doubled. They just come in either metallic or flocked. Yeah, it looks like it's just the Saiyan Saga with Vegeta and Nappa. And yeah, the... that's what it seems like. But really cool. They're really cool. Yeah, they are really cool. Uh, all right, so we are on the Pixar calendar. So again, guys, so we have the Pixar calendar. And we ended with Onward, right? I don't know, so I don't know if this is onward or if we're moving on to some, if we're moving onward to something else. Probably moving See what on I to did there? Else. See what I did there, Wingles? Yes, I did. <laughs> All right, so let's take a look, see what we have under day 18. Oh, and we have. These are like the hardest thing to get out. We have Mr. Incredible. Well, that's cool. That's really cool. So we have moved onward to something different. We have. See what I did there? <laughs> we have. We moved on to the Incredibles. Again, guys, we're probably not going to keep these. So, um, probably going to group them up and use them as part of a giveaway or something. Or, you know, we'll see. We'll do something with them maybe this year, next year. I don't even know yet. Uh, so today being the 18th, uh, mini mystery day is for me. The right. bag's almost I know, it's almost gone. All right, what I got here is a Power Rangers Mighty Clip Charm. These are the different ones. So let's see what we got. Oh, oh, we got the blue Power Ranger. That's cool. It is kind of cool really cool so do you have a favorite power ranger wingles um it depends on which power ranger you're looking at like which suit like yeah because this one only has three of the power rangers it has the yellow the red and the blue or is that one also 
No, that's the Mechazord. Yeah, that's what I thought. So this one only comes with three of the Power Rangers. But I know there's a pink. And what other color? A white? A, a white, a black, a pink, a green. Oh, see, there's a lot. Um, a lot more than I thought. Yeah, there's so many. But really cool. Really, really cool. I really like this. So, so guys, that's day 18. As you see, we're like right around the corner. Christmas is going to be here before we even know it. Yep. So hopefully everybody's staying healthy and safe. And uh, But we will see you guys in the next video. Mm. Bye!